Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is almost uh, two o'clock and we just finished putting up the trim in the dining room. Um, I have footage from two days ago and then I have some footage from yesterday that I was gonna put in today's vlog, but um, that footage was just gonna be me um, going for a photo shoot for Maylee and it was an epic fail. I was gonna do it at the beach and it was so windy and so cold um, that it just wasn't gonna look good and it wasn't gonna work. So I'm gonna retry to take photos today. I'm gonna see if Adam can take a couple of me and Maylee and maybe we can set up the tripod and take a couple of the three of us as a family. Um, it's not super windy out, it's slightly sunny, so it's pretty, pretty good weather for um, a photo shoot because it's not too sunny and um, it's not too windy so we are gonna try again today um, but I will also show you guys a little bit later today I'll show you guys the dining room too with the rest of the trim up but I will insert um, probably this part of the vlog first and then I will have to go in and put in the other day's part because I did not open the vlog that day so it's gonna be kind of jumbled into one but hey it's fine. Okay, you guys, you can probably hear puppy dog pals in the background, <laughs> but I am just pulling out my camera because I wanted to show you a before of my wall. When we moved in, I really liked the green and the brown together, but as we get the house like going more, I mean, we've been here a year, so I just really wanna get gray in a lot of the rooms of the house. So we have Maylee's room is gray, our room is gray, the bathroom is gray, and then I'm going to keep this, this brown color, um, just because I like it and it kind of flows all the way through, but I want this wall to be gray, and then eventually, sorry my house is a mess, I have a bunch of dishes to do, but, and then I want all those walls to be gray so I just am not a huge fan of the green like I thought it would be um at first I really liked it but now I just kind of want to have like a more simple house and I'm trying to declutter as much as possible <laughs> so I have like bags and bags of stuff to take to Goodwill I'll have to show you guys in a little bit but this is the before product I still have to tape off the walls and everything and tape around the trim and I have to take the outlet covers off but I started, um, I ripped down the trim that was around these beams and we're going to put up other trim on each side and we're going to sand these beams the same color as the wood that's in our bathroom. And then Adam's going to move this light fixture. I don't know who put this light fixture in but Adam's going to move the light fixture to the center of these beams because it literally makes no sense where it's at. Like, look, no sense whatsoever when the table's like centered here. So Adam's going to move this over here probably sometime during this quarantine, but this is the next project and this is the before. Okay, I just wanted to pull out my camera um, and show what it looks like so far. I don't know why the first coat always looks so bad, but taking a minute break, my shoulders are on fire. <laughs> but um, this wall is pretty much, it's a little bit tacky still, but this wall is done. Um, I just need to do another coat, but I don't know if I said this, but I'm going to do trim around the top, so that's why I'm leaving a um, gap there, because we decided we're going to do... Um, like a crown but we're just going to use the same trim that we use on the ground so yeah and i'm trying really hard not to get um paint on my brand new rug i'll show you guys my dining room setup and everything i'll put back together when the walls are painted but look how weird the first coat looks it always looks like that the first coat is so scary and then it dries and you put on a second coat and it looks fine well, even this. Like, that's one coat. This is just a shadow from the... But that's one coat and it looks fine. So why does it look weird when it's wet? Sorry, you can probably hear the TV in the background. Maylee is still napping. I can't believe it. 
But yeah, that's update number one. All right, so I'm taking a little break from painting, but I just wanted to show you this little cutie pie. You say hi. Say hi to everyone. Hello. <laughs> um, this dish is so great. It suctions to the um, tray here. Yeah. <laughs> And it's perfect because we'll put like her little yogurt bites in here and then like her veggie. And then in here we'll put like her main entree. Right now she's having chicken and french fries. <laughs> Go ahead. She loves chicken. It's like one of her favorites. But And then the bib. <laughs> we'll catch most of her stuff. Whoa. Well, there goes the diapers. That was her diapers. We just got her diapers in the mail today. Yeah, say hello. I'm so big. Say I'll be eight months old in two days. <laughs> but I just got these from Meyer, and I think they're the Munchkin brand. I'm not 100% sure, but I'll link them down in the description box for you guys. I'm sure you can get them anywhere, like off Amazon or anything, but... Yeah, look how big she is. <laughs> And then this is what's happening right now. It looks, I feel like the room looks bigger. I don't know if it's just me or what, but this area is still drying a little bit, but you can tell that this wall and that wall are dry and they don't look as weird. Paint always looks so weird when it, before it dries, but looks so good. We're having chicken and fries. <laughs> Real good. Right, Eddie? Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's been working on the roof all day. It's a little bit tired. A little bit sleepy. Not this one. She just napped. <laughs> yeah. We're in the midst of putting up trim. Looks really good so far. We have just that piece over there. And I put my organizing calendar stuff back up. I need to kind of like organize, um, put like the dates on the calendar and wipe the dry erase board. But um, Adam's about to trim that corner piece and then trim around the window. And I'm gonna get ready to sweep the floors, so. <laughs> He's tired, he's been working on the roof all day. Did you just kill a bug? Spider. <gasps> Spiders think that they can just come and go in this house. Did that look okay, vlog? <laughs> <laughs> Need a haircut. Get one. I know. All the barber shops are closed. All right, you guys. So it's almost complete. Um, I just went through and organized everything. Um, that bag right there needs to go back to Adam's parents' house. But um, I put just the necessities on the coat rack there, and then the bag goes back to his parents, so that'll be gone tomorrow. He has not gotten to the trim around the window yet. Um, it got super late and it's dark out, so he was like, can I just do it tomorrow? I was like, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> but I went through these and I cleaned them all out. Um, this, I think I'm gonna take take away um just because it's like this is my christmas bouquet and i didn't even realize it until like i was putting stuff back on here so we'll just stick with that for now i'm going for as simple as possible anyway so and then this is my bar cart my empty wine rack <laughs> um eventually i know i'm gonna have to move probably all of this or at least keep maylee out of here but this still looks good the trim looks amazing 
Um, yeah, so the only thing that's not really done yet is this here. And Adam's going to put a piece of trim here in our bathroom. We have like a half. It's half the, um, what would you say, the width of that. So it'll only come to like probably here. And we're going to put trim pieces here and here. And then again here and then on the other side there. But like you can tell we need it. Like it just looks bad. So we're going to be doing that tomorrow. But like I said, it just got really late. That and he's going to trim in around the beam too. But we need to stain it and all that good stuff and sand it. And in order to sand it, we have to take everything out of the kitchen. So we're just not going to be doing that right now. But over here, we have a new slider door. So I'm going to see if Adam will put it in for me. Um, sometime probably next week but we have a white slider as you can tell the wood is definitely like outdated or dated whatever you would say but so we have a white slider it's out in the garage we just need to put it in and then we're gonna obviously put the same white trim over it like over around it so that's gonna be there right here I had like a little like envelope thing for mail and then like a little wall art thing and then over here I had um I already took the screw out but I had like a it said like it was a chalkboard and it said keys please and I had that there and I decided that I'm just gonna order from Amazon I'm just gonna order like a combo thing so like a spot to put the mail a spot to put your keys you know just like the whole thing on this wall here because it was like weirdly it was like too busy in that tiny little corner and it just was bothering me so I'm trying my hardest to do like more simple stuff like I just want everything to be more like simple so I don't want it to be cluttered and yeah so same thing with the door Adam's gonna trim it in tomorrow but he needed a tool to like cut because the trim piece is bigger, so he has to cut a little bit of that trim piece off. And Maylee was sleeping by the time that he got to this, so he's like, well, I honestly think that that would wake her, wake her up. So her bedroom's literally, like, right up there. Like, <laughs> her, her, like, window looks out into the yard right there, so her window's, like, right there. So we definitely didn't want to wake her up, and she had, like, just gone down, but... Yeah, we're gonna trim that in, and I really need to take a magic eraser to this door. It is so dirty. I haven't cleaned it. Okay, I can't believe I'm saying this on my vlog, but I haven't cleaned it since we moved in, and we've been here a year. So I really, really, really need to clean that door, but... And then over here, I have just, like, all Josie's stuff. I actually... I know it looks like a lot for one dog. There's, like, different leashes, but... She's got a bunch of different leashes and a couple different collars under there, but um, super cute little rack. I got it from Big Lots. I don't know if it's still there, but it's little puppy butts. Um, but I cleaned off half of what was on there. Same thing here. We're going to be putting a like trim piece in there as well. And I haven't gotten to... Our kitchen is like three different colors right now. It's the brown, the gray, and the green, but... I haven't gotten to behind the fridge yet, and then I also haven't gotten to, like, this whole area. But I don't know. It's going to probably take a minute before I get the motivation to do this again. <laughs> Especially around the cupboards and stuff, because you can't really, like, use a roller. I mean, you can, but you have to, like, tape everything off and move everything out of the way. And it's just, like, I have to have some extreme motivation to be wanting to do that but yeah so I was a little nervous with how the brown was gonna look into the gray but with the beam being there I like it and like the plant it kind of like separates I don't know if that's just me but it kind of just separates the room like this is the part of the living room and then this is the dining room so I don't know I think it looks really good it definitely brightened up this space a lot. 
but once again we're going to be moving that light to the center this probably gives you a better idea of how weird it looks where it's at I don't know whoever built this house I have no idea what their logic was but that's going to be moved to there and right centered above the table too so I think that's going to look really good oh and I almost forgot to tell you guys this is my new rug that I got from Amazon and it was a really really amazing price you guys it's giant for one oh yeah I have a basket hidden back there it's just like a bunch of random stuff I need to put away and then like the I don't know if you can see <laughs> down there that's the curtain that's gonna go up above that window but anyway so this Amazon rug it was only it's a seven by t or yeah seven by ten foot which is giant but I think it looks amazing with the tile I've always wanted since we moved in I wanted a rug really bad for under the table but I wanted it to be light I wanted it to be white but I didn't want to get all white so this is perfect for what we wanted but this rug you guys was only I think it was only $85 which is amazing, amazing for a rug that size and that quality. Like, it's really good quality. So, and our dining room is huge, so it, it fits really nicely. It doesn't blend in too much, but it also doesn't stand out too much. So, I will get out the camera again tomorrow and show you guys um, what it looks like with the um, trim around the window, the trim around the door the curtains back up, and the trim around the beams. So I will show you guys all that tomorrow. And yeah, but that is it for tonight. And I'm off to bed. Oh, that's better. Oh, that's better. Can you show everybody how you can stand up? Show everyone how you can stand up. Turn off her sound machine. Show everybody. Show everyone. There you go. Come on, big girl. Oh, big muscles. Big muscles. Are you ready to take a photo shoot? <laughs> Just got up from a nap, huh? Just got up from a nap. Didn't you? Oh, always smacking around. Always smacking it around. Ow. Ow, Z. Ow, Z. <laughs> She's looking at herself in the viewfinder. Who is that baby in there? Who is that baby? Ow! So we were able to get a couple photos of me and Maylee, um, and she's eating right now. And then um, I'm gonna change her outfit, and we're gonna go outside for round two. Um, these photos are gonna be like just her, and I'm hoping that she cooperates because I have really cute photo props for it, and. I just have a vision in my head, so I'm like really hoping that they turn out. Her Easter photos turned out phenomenal. They were so cute. Um, Adam helped me get her to smile and all that good stuff. So I'm hoping that I'm hoping that when we get out there, she's smiley and we can just take a couple pics and come back inside. So fingers crossed. So, Maylee is down for another nap. We were able to get Mommy and Me pictures done 
but when she gets up from her nap, we'll probably give her a little snack and then we'll head back outside to do her eight month photos. But I'm really happy that we were able to get the mommy and me ones done. So that's what we're doing. But I wanted to show you guys the trim in the kitchen real quick. Okay, so starting over here, um, we just had to kind of split the trim. So we need to paint still like in here because he had to like split the pieces of trim in half but um, also the wood this part like I already said we are going to my nails are awful I'm gonna paint them tonight <laughs> but we're going to sand this down and do it the same color like a little bit darker than this so um, I think that'll look a lot better but he trimmed around the bottom here trimmed around here on the sides because obviously before you could see like the crack and then like the foam insulation you guys have already seen the trim around the top and then the window trim sorry my camera automatically kind of like darkens when it sees light but the window trim Adam just needs to put the curtain back up um, which is not a huge deal I want to go in and um, like clean the window and clean the ledge and all that because we have old windows in our kitchen um that one and then the one over by the sink but yeah we aren't getting new windows for a little bit so i was like you know what just go ahead and put up the trim and we'll just put up new trim when we get new windows it's not a big deal but adam put that up and then he also put up the trim around the door which, let's see if I can turn this light on. There we go. That's a little better. But, yeah, there's a trim around the door. Goes all the way down to the floor, obviously. But I think that it turned out really nice. I'm really happy with the way that the gray looks. I'm happy with the way the trim looks. And it's just a lot classier, I think, and a little bit more modern. So I can't wait to move this over. It's driving me nuts. But yeah, there is our little two-day dining room renovation. Always up for a quick reno. All right, so we managed to get a couple eight month photos. Um, I'll probably try again tomorrow just because she's kind of cranky and it's a little bit cold out at this point. It don't rain. <laughs> so she's gonna have some more food and then we're gonna give her a bath and put her to bed. So I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. Um, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, Adam. <laughs> I'm breaking stuff. Sorry. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Clean it. That's clean. <laughs> and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.